If none of you guys saw that coming after what happened to Brad, then fool you. I mean, Isabella's even got a line of dialogue earlier on that says she couldn't tell if there was a fight wound or not after Barnaby attacked her. So it was yeah. kind of obvious it was going to happen. That, and I've played it before, so... <laughs> Jesse. I love that. This one time he thinks, no, you know what? I'm going to call first. Are you ready for this? That guy's on the floor. Yep, the glasses. Is she again? I always forget. Ah, oh, there she is. And remember, snap a photo, Perfect. get an achievement. Well, I've already got that one, but yeah. <laughs> also, all the survivors are now gone. Every single one of them. Um, which is a bit disheartening, but at least they're not constantly saying, Why is this happening? Every time I come back here. Okay, so I'm just going to save that, and then we'll continue onwards. Okay, so carrying straight onwards. Um, off we go. So the soldiers are still there. Lovely, and I believe this is a note from Otis. Uh, what it basically says is that Otis saw the soldiers coming and hightailed it. Um, so presumably, Otis is alive out there somewhere. But yeah, what a dick, huh? He just kind of ran and saved his own skin, and said sod it to everyone else. Charming. So yeah, um, basically I'm just going to head back across now. Um, hmm, it's a shame I didn't get to show you guys Cheryl's request, but um, I really should have planned for that. In fact, with the amount of time left when I got to Isabella, there probably would have been enough time to have done it when I got the call. Um, so yeah, my bad, I apologise. So the army's going to arrive in, what, one hour? Well, one hour in game, it won't be one hour real time. Yeah, I'm just trying to figure this out in my head at the moment. Yeah, okay, so just head straight back across there. Uh... But yeah, um, bar a couple of cutscenes, um, we're pretty much done for the 72 hour mode. Like I said, the third day, really nothing happens. I've always been quite disappointed with the final day in this game, actually. This seems like such a... I don't know. 
Just could have had a bit more oomph to it at the end, I think. Yeah. So we are going to need as many queens as we can get. Um, again, if you've played before, you'll know exactly what I'm on about. Otherwise, hang on, you'll soon see. Straight back to Isabella. Hmm. Sorry about that, someone was at the door. <laughs> anyway, yeah, I'm just trying to think now, because uh, the cutscene's not going to happen till midnight. Ooh. Bugger it, let's cut ahead. Okay, and we're back. Oh, so the cutscene's about to start. Um, and then from there, it's another ten in-game hours. Um, where nothing happens. So, after the cutscene, there'll probably be another cut ahead. But I'll explain more in a moment. And here comes the cutscene. Midnight. when it loads. There we go. Yep, it's... well, the reinforcements. Well, not the reinforcements, the cleanup squad. Eh, pick your own name for them. You know, I gotta say, these guys remind me of um, Hunk out of Resident Evil 2. Maybe Capcom did that on purpose. Or maybe I'm just seeing things where they aren't there. You tell me. <laughs> the military. They'll come, won't they? Well, provided they can find the place, yeah. Just like Santa Cabeza. The government wants to cover this up, too. Well, would you put your hands up and admit to it? Really? So, yeah, basically, I don't think there's anything else um, I can actually do until it hits um, 10 in the morning now. I mean, I can always go and screw with, um, because the soldiers are now in the mall, and there's a helicopter flying around outside. If you take out ten of the soldiers in the helicopter, you get an achievement for each. By the way, I'm going to save it here, and then we'll cut ahead to 10am, because I already have those achievements. Okay, catch you next time. Okay, we're back again. Um, like I said, that was... 10 hours of in-game time we cut there. Um, basically, you can spend from midnight to 10 in the morning just, you know, screwing around with the soldiers and, like I said, if you want to go shoot down that helicopter that appears outside. Outside of that, there are no cases, no survivors, no nothing. Um, so I really didn't think it was worth having 10 hours of in-game time of just me pratting about. So I cut ahead. Very close to that helicopter getting here now. <laughs> 